Tornadoes have killed more than 500 people so far this year, and the season lasts at least another month. Early show contributor Tyler McGill went to Oklahoma City to follow one storm chaser and his crew, featured in their own show on the Discovery Channel. When an EF5 tornado devastated Joplin, Missouri last Sunday, some of the most dramatic images were captured by storm chasers, people who make a living filming tornadoes and gathering information about these forces of nature. Look at that. That's happening. See? We gotta get east immediately, actually. From April to June, Reed Timmer and his team from tornadovideos.net monitor radar and crisscross the country chasing weather systems to gather data about these towering storms. I think you really have to be passionate and almost obsessed with tornadoes and meteorology to, to be a storm chaser and, and to do it for a living. Most storm chasers film from afar, but Reed and his team put themselves directly into the path of oncoming storms using their specifically outfitted half-ton car they christened the Dominator 2. I've been going to school for the last 13 years trying to build a foundation so I can better understand tornadoes. And the final piece of the puzzle was this armored tank. Seats are limited inside the vehicle, but they invited us to join them as they track storms in Oklahoma. We followed the Dominator 2, a medical van, and the rest of their crew as they spent the day tracking twisters. Wow, you can see the entire wall cloud starting to develop to our right. We're getting off in Elk City, and it looks like we got a good chance of seeing our first tornado today. <sighs> starting to feel the nerves. What are we looking at right now? Yeah, right now we've got a developing wall cloud. It's already rotating. And uh, what'll happen is we have westerly winds here, so the circulation will tighten up to our north. And that's the formation of a wall cloud and the precursors to a tornado. Near Gracemont in western Oklahoma, Reed led the team straight towards a developing tornado. Driving right into the heart of the, the, heart of the storm right now. Look at the cattle going nuts. The animals are freaking out. Looks like they can sense something. Using information from the National Weather Service, Reed and his team are able to follow and anticipate where the storm is headed. But these powerful weather systems can be incredibly unpredictable, as we found out. Watch for ground circulation. They said the tornado is going to drop right here. We got to go. We got to go. We got to go. We got to go. Wow. First tornado just touched down right to our left. Reed's work is providing valuable information about these natural forces of destruction. It's a dangerous, life-threatening profession that could save lives in the future. It's uh, very motivating to continue to call in those reports and continue our research to better understand these tornadoes to uh, eventually increase warning lead times. If we could stop the tornadoes, we would. But all we can do now is try to better understand them and call in those warnings and try to keep those people safe. Tyler McGill, CBS News. Dangerous work, gotta be a professional.